Dr. Baumgart, what is the difference between a tricyclic antidepressant and an SSRI? What is that? So a tricyclic antidepressant is a medication that affects more neurotransmitters. So by neurotransmitters, I mean different chemicals in the brain. So a uh, tricyclic antidepressant may affect the regulation and the movement between nerve cells and neurons mm -hmm. of dopamine, norepinephrine, and serotonin. Mm -hmm. An SSRI or a selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor specifically targets, uh, targets the action of serotonin. Yeah. So a tricyclic antidepressant may have more effects. I think a tricyclic antidepressant may have potentially more side effects. Uh, a tricyclic antidepressant may have some safety concerns and overdose or mm -hmm. with certain medical conditions. So in some cases, they've fallen out of favor. Mm -hmm. SSRI antidepressants are generally more commonly prescribed in medications that I would certainly start with. Yeah. And interestingly, one of the reasons that the SSRIs are more favored than the tricyclic antidepressants, who are a little bit older, is that the amount one would have to take of an SSRI to get toxic and have potentially fatal consequences is insanely high. So when we're prescribing these medications specifically to like majorly depressed, perhaps suicidal patients, it's much safer to give them a bottle of pills like SSRIs that can't actually be used as a tool to attempt or commit suicide. The tricyclics you have to watch out for at too high of doses, there can be cardiovascular issues, arrhythmia issues. There's certain patient populations that have arrhythmias that we do not want to use TCAs with. That being said, are tricyclics the first line I go to to treat OCD? No, but do I go to TCAs like clomipramine, aka anaphronil, sure. if the SSRIs have been exhausted? Yes.